It was amazing. Thank you. I'm getting so emotional too. Oh, it's God, okay? I'll take you over the cam. I like the quality. Hey I love guys. it. Oh, hey guys, welcome today. back. Hola. Welcome back. Motivation for me, okay? This lady is motivating and I'm here for it, okay? Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> I miss this, you know. I really I miss it. I'm yeah. so happy that we could have it. I'm really happy to be here, Aww. guys. Finally, <laughs> you brought me out. You know, today is the day, and thank you I for bringing me out. Oh you know? man, I'm thank so you happy. So it's literally the guardian angels and God that? and everything that's happening. Amen. You're right. Amen. <laughs> yeah. YouTube channel for those of you who do not know who I am, Ikamalangu Babala Wa Kwan Joana. And today we've got the one, the only Vicky V Jonas herself. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> Hi guys, hey yo, hey everyone. Dude, guys, can we please just look at how beautiful this lady is? is. And she's so handy so or not. Like she's Thank such a so lady. Much. Like she's I thought I was a lady until I met you. No, you're making me feel like you are Anna. <laughs> oh, no, no, don't even feel that way. You see, as I'm a guy, sometimes you just need to, you know, and then, oh gosh, and then, put yourself together, you know. But yeah, thank you so much for the compliment. I really love and it. Yo, yes. thank you so much for joining me. I've been meaning for, like, us to have this conversation. Yeah. To sit down, do a chit chat. This is long. Over, this was long overdue, guys. Okay, long yes, overdue. Very, and very, very much long overdue. So, guys, in this video, it's really just gonna be us girls chatting, women. Actually, you know. Let me correct that. Us women chatting. Um, I'm gonna be asking Vicky some questions, and she's also gonna be asking me a few questions because we're both women um, that live in Cape Town that are in the social media space. Um, and I've always, obviously, also wanted to just get into your head and oh. head space. <laughs> Do oh I have been like doing this for a while, yes, you know? Yes, so, yes. so I'm glad that we actually finally got to do this. Oh, I'm so happy I'm to be here. Like happy. finally, I'm really happy. Thank you and so then? much. Yes. Okay, cool. So, yes. for the people on my channel that do not know who okay. you are, where you're from, tell us a little bit about who Ubiki is, um, where she was born, uh, where she went to school, okay. and 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 and. Okay. Hi guys, my name is Vicky Jonas. I am a God-fearing woman, number one. Okay, mm, I that. am um, a YouTuber as well, an influencer. Um, I'm born and raised in Cape Town. To so those who don't know, um, I went to you know Vista High School in town. I don't know if you, I don't know, if you know in Vista High School. Do you know? oh, yeah. So yeah, I went to Vista High School. So in high school, guys, I always knew that I wanted to be in the entertainment in industry, like media, you know. The reason why I started my channel is because I wanted to be an actress. So oh, wow. when you, I used the channel Yam to help me get out of land. Because you know, it's not easy, guys, getting in front of the camera and talking to people, sure. hey? Like, it looks it easy. Isn't. So I think I used my channel to you know to be in front of the camera because if I want to do all these things I need to get used to it so I opened my channel and you know some of you guys who know me enjoyed my videos and it helped me gain that yeah. confidence you put me out there do you understand mm -hmm. so yeah I've been doing this now for some time and honestly it's been an amazing journey mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. it has its ups and downs mm -hmm. but you know this is what we do we love it so yeah that's who Vicky Beach Jonas is Right. Yes. Wow. Thank you so much for that. That intro. Intro. Yeah. Yeah. Like, <laughs> give it gives a picture of like to someone that obviously hasn't known mm. about who Uviki is yeah. and where she comes from and why she actually got into mm. the social media and YouTube space. Girl, oh now I I always wanted to start a YouTube channel, mm. but I would ask myself, oh, Viki and oh, Like yeah. it's story yeah. time is again. Yeah. <laughs> no, that, I think to me it comes naturally, like the tongue is dead and the tongue bodies, so you know, mm. come here back, detect, you know, mm. that's just, you know, just be yourself when in front of the camera, that's what I've learned, so that's it's true. so easy, when you, especially true. when you're being yourself, go for yeah, it. Flow, uh, mm. Yeah, flow, yeah, flow, and So it's actually so interesting that you said that you wanted to get into acting and you used YouTube as an avenue to get into that space, yes. and it's gotten you yes. so 
spa, which yes. is actually so crazy. So looking at that, do you think that you still want to get into the acting space? Or are you happy to do... Because social media is a whole career now. I know, right? It's literally mm. a whole career on its own. So would you want to still pursue the whole acting, acting TV and, and kind and of thing? Or like, are you happy to just be like a content creator, creator and do your own thing and your own pace, your own time? Mm-mm. Right now, like, I, I think I, I'm mm-hmm. on social media. You know, I've learned everything that I had, you know, I had to learn with social media. Mm-hmm. I'm ready for it now because... I I haven't tried it yet. You want your audition for acting because I was still trying to build that confidence and also get to know about Mabanjani on social media. So mm. now that I know, I think I'm ready, man. Like, You're ready, I man. Ready, man. Like, and I'm I can definitely to see you, yeah. not just yeah. through Kali, girl. Mm. <laughs> oh, I received your name of Jesus. Oh, but I want to know, like, when. I want to oh. know because you know you've been doing this thing and go with the identity. Yes, I'm enjoying watching you and your husband. You know, posting content and just to you know, mm-hmm. you spoke a different side to you know love relationships that healthy love to me that's so inspiring and mm-hmm. go the away like I, I watch your videos and it and yes man it, it brings something out of me like it oh, lies you guys are gonna lie to us you understand so like since you've been doing this now how has it been for you guys like how has the journey wow. been it's been amazing because like you mm. I've also wanted always wanted to be on TV ever since I was a little girl mm-hmm. I was like I entered pageants mm. I um, auditioned for so many things like growing up and stuff and I made it on some and I didn't make it on some mm. so when I met my husband he was like this is what you love like why don't you do it why don't you go for it so he did he like he bought this camera without it's the me support even knowing. Me. Guys, yeah. like, ah, uh, shame. He, he's really pushed me to get out of my comfort zone, to mm. not be scared or nervous. He's like, dude, don't be, because I'm very afraid of failure. Mm. So mm. he's really challenged me not to be afraid of failure. Mm. And the whole thing of us as a couple being on social mm. media was never planned. It literally just happened accidentally where he was supposed to feature once mm. on my channel. Mm. When we first started, and then he became a a regular feature. And both of us are actually in that space now. It's Mm -hmm. really opened so many doors Doors. for us. Mm -hmm. Like, in terms of work, Mm -hmm. like, I'm blown away sometimes by the work that we actually... You understand? No, I, yeah, yeah. No, it's such a beautiful, um, you know, thing to experience and watch. When it, especially when it comes to a couple on YouTube, we don't really see much, you know, a couples. So, you know, I really love and enjoy watching you guys. And there's something that I really want to ask. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think it's that deep. Okay, 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 okay. Um, I just want to know because you know one thing about me in Dinendo, I'm scared to go out there and post my relationships because right. it's like a relationship that's out there, right? Mm. And the experience from that it traumatized me to to, to a point where I feel like I'm about to. They're so in they my are business. Brutal. You understand? Mm. So I just want to know, like, how do you handle that? Obviously, you know, you know, it's uh, your husband, but it, it, do you find any challenges when you put out your relationship out there? Mm. I do find a lot of challenges, especially because I am married and young. Mm. Not just married, like we are young and we are married. Sometimes I feel like women just don't respect boundaries. Mm. Like, mm. women do not respect boundaries. How, like, it's just, it's crazy for me how women just will do crazy stuff. Like, Can will I say also? crazy <laughs> Like in, in person or like you know in person and on in on the social media space. Like mm. for example, if my husband is very vocal, he's loud, mm. and if there's something wrong, he will tell me. Mm-hmm. Like he's not a person that's secretive mm. or funny. So he'll go on a live and then like girls will just and I watch your lives, guys. Oh my goodness, I enjoy, 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 enjoy. Dude, yeah. Yeah. thank you so yeah. much. Mm-hmm. And it, it's crazy because. Like Uzola is very out there, like he's not a reserved person, he interacts a lot with his followers, way more than I do actually, Mm -hmm. if we really come to think about it. So like people will just do funny things, people don't have to say certain things Mm -hmm. sometimes but you know you can read energies Mm -hmm. and I'm just like, um, excuse me, you know, know? and yeah, and shame to be honest with you, I don't think I've ever been in a situation where, okay, well, my husband has never put me in a situation where I feel disrespected Mm -hmm. by a woman, Mm -hmm. like he'll always 
like put me at a place where I am respected, mm. you know. Mm. So I have never again. Mm. I don't know. I've never come across like a shady thing. <laughs> Okay. Like he's never put me in an awkward situation where I'm like questioning mm. him or I'm like, mm. what's this? And he's a friendly person. Like he talks to no. girls and a lot of people. Mm. So it's also had to put me in a place where I'm like, I actually am not threatened mm. because he's like he's never really put me in a situation where I'm like. Why are you talking to this girl? Go. Why are you following this girl? Why are you liking their pictures? Mm. Or what's happening? <laughs> okay, about that, Nick. Right? Can I actually tell you something? Since we're talking about relationships, I've actually mm. had someone on Jan, like, so friendly. Mm. At that time, I don't think I understood Lam, do you understand? Because mm. maybe Lam is insecurity is Zaman Yongelon. Mm. But I didn't like how, you know, he is. Uh, yeah. And Abanya Bandu Mbaya's Jula, in a way, I'm like, okay, but so I wonder like how do you you know how do you stay calm like all know your friend you know what I mean like yeah it's difficult it takes a lot of training obviously in the beginning I was also like mm, what the hell you can't be following these people and liking their pictures because I can see you are liking all of these pictures you liked it you liked it, you liked it. Mm. and it took me like Sometimes. Some time to actually grow because I'm like this person, like who right man? I got I got go find Like even before I was in the picture, this is how he was. He was. And mm. we are talking about but even in my family, mm. like the relationship he has with my sister, in mm. a siblings, by mm. a And if I was someone else, I'd be like, mm. why do you call my why? sister to get caught? Until I don't know sister, do you know what I mean? Mm. And obviously, I've had like I've gone through. The worst relationships, mm. so I Give was so traumatized, so traumatized that I had zero trust for men. Mm. I was like, yeah. they are all dogs. They will mm. don't they don't care about us. They mm. do not care. And then slowly but surely, the trust started coming and building the confidence of. But at the end of the day, no matter who's and I slide that into ATMs. Sweetie, I got some men who you understand what I mean. I saw so with this conversation that we're having now. I'm learning something that um to buy in general, you, like you shouldn't think one like um because now I used to be so toxic. I'm not gonna lie because I used to ask why you like it, but you're like you like you know what you're saying, and there was no trust there at all. Why you like it, but you're like why why you know? But why now you acting with this person, don't, 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 don't. but also it comes with ubani no calling you without fighting. Uchoba, babe, why is this happening? Like. To me, it's a trigger because of X, Y, and Z. Please, can you be wary of that? We are born until I've reached a point where I'm comfortable. Mm, we are born. I've like got healing to do. Kule i situation. Na ya ag understand. I'm ag ateki ba. Oh, you've got insecurities. I make good defense mode, but ah, nah, nah. Cause sometimes guys can do that. Yeah, but yeah, but without yeah. me calling, but okay, baby, I understand this. It, it makes you feel this way. Mm. Ne? Mm. We will go get through this. You mm. know, like not ba. Now I was in a situation like that that made me feel like I'm and whenever I, you know there is a lot, I'm not happy with how this is. No, mm. I insecure. That already makes me feel like I I can't stand it because oh, why oh, you know oh, let's. Mm. You know, the thing that I'm learning now from you is that the approach and just telling them, listen, because I didn't do that. And then you're like, hey, why, why, why? Come on, because you are so used to people hurting you. You are so used to right. these things. And you make a relationship with the past dropouts, I've been doing, you know. So it's all about finding someone who understands you. That's what I'm learning. And someone who communicates, mm -hmm. like communication. And that's really a powerful thing in a relationship. Yeah, I feel like we're talking about relationships. <laughs> I'm a doctor. Oh, no, I'm not doctor. That's my break. You know, I'm just taking a break. I just focus on myself, man. You know, I just oh, need uh, man. just to relax. Your aura, and I'm a person that I sense energy oh, so sense. much. Oh, sense! And then when you're in peace of combat, behave, be man. I'm out, heavenly kind of. And then, Do you understand? Yeah. Like, you have money. Like, what, oh, like, like you know, I know when I'm not happy, I don't like being around people because I'm very feel I'm an energy I'm not okay. So sometimes, I'm mm -hmm. around, I'm not happy, 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 I'
when you want to be happy and find a peace within, spread that happiness. Yeah, you be happy, like you be happy, but nice, come on your band, you understand, and be kind, and then you get that back. You yeah. understand? That's true. So, you need to take time and you know focus on a peace. Yeah, go protect it. Stay ready for relationship in the room. That's your only relationship. But in the meantime, no. you know, relax. That's true. <laughs> and it's so important to jump from one to another because. At the end of the day, that's gonna catch up with you mm. and how you are mm. and act in a relationship. So you know, I, and then something else that I would love for us to talk about, you know, since we we're talking about relationships, you know, mm. because when you, you know, relationships, there's you know, friendships now and other things. You go on like your work and and and. The process of you finding umtuako and uben umtuako. Did you lose some people? How did you handle that? Mm. Go on, do you still have the same people in your life, the same friends, mm. or it's people that you all divide and go like? Oh, you know, because you know, I struggle with that in Ibonaki relationships and I don't know how to pick this to show me from Okobadi. And then you know, when they in your business like that, you know, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. so how did you, you know, do that? Do so, yo, for me and my husband, when we got together, we literally forgot about everyone. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> Like nobody existed. Like he had, he lost his friends. I lost my friends, and we literally started from scratch. Like I was quite fortunate, and because he was looking to build a family, and I was also looking into build a family. So I feel like there was so much God involved in the whole thing. Like gossip galen, because when I look back now, I'm like that was not a coincidence. That was God's hand. Watching over us and mm-hmm. being like, ah, oh, Abba, perfect for each other, you know. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. yeah, like in the beginning, right? When I fall out in your okay. Now me I moved to Joburg. I basically had no friends in Cape Town. Mm-hmm. I met him. All my friends were out of town. Oh, so and then when our relationship got serious, like we started new relationships, and both him and I make a decision of are these healthy people for oh, our marriage? Mm-hmm. Are these the right friends to have? He obviously has got his friends. He boys is okay. Mm-hmm. And one thing I really want to emphasize okay. to us as ladies is that men ne like having downtime. Mm. They like going to hang with boys. And I used to have a problem with that. Yeah, me too! <laughs> <laughs> I hate to like, 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 understand. You tell me, on time, you tell me, yeah. Why mm. must you go hang out with the boys for hours? Mm. Mm. But they need that downtime. Mm. My uncle told me when I was getting married that my male like, when I was like, and you spend so much time together. Ne? But because of our connect pressure for our own nigga is space, and I you hang out with it boys because men at his age enjoy being away from women at some point mm. because we stress men out a lot. So yeah. Yeah. Come on, baby, this, baby, yeah. that, 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 literally, literally. <laughs> literally, and it's healthy yeah. for him to go and relax and mm. a breathe, a breathe, you know, and have and a life. Because boys do stupid things when they're together. Mm. So I'm like, okay, how is this fun? And that's what they want. They men hate being mm-hmm. controlled. They hate being controlled. So when he can have time away from you, that to him is reboot for ba. I will let back. I quasi, you know, to mm-hmm. enjoy time with you. Not that he hates you. Mm-hmm. Not that he doesn't love you. Mm-hmm. Or it has anything to do with the relationship. It's just them being men being. Men. And we don't understand that. Tina, I see. Class number two, I see. I'm like, I'm choosing. No, I, I never. I don't know. Not even know, guys. But you know, now I think that sometimes when you need to have like a life outside of a relationship, you're going to be like, "What man, you're stressing. Why are you going to lie? But why? Why? But now they need a time. They will relax and enjoy each other. The same way, you're trying to use your hand. You're making wine from. You have a, you know, all relaxed that man and have a glass of. With you understand? You know, oh, yeah. <laughs> And you laugh at your own nonsense mm. as well as ladies, you know. Yes. So I think it's 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 really important to find a balance mm. that, and it's difficult. I won't lie because sometimes when you go out, he's not going to be happy. Mm. He's obviously also going to feel some type of like, oh, mm. and it's not only us that feel that way. They also yeah. feel that way. They're like, oh, she's got a life without me. Mm. <laughs> I got <laughs> Now you feel like having a stress sometimes. Mm. And stress in a relationship is healthy. Okay, we are got it. 
Speaking of healthy relationships, yes. I want to ask you a question. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Awesome. The same question that you're asking myself. Like, obviously, you are in the social media space, and I would say that is the limelight. Like, your, your yeah. life is in the limelight, and you're known. How has the journey been between, like, for you amongst determining? What are the healthy people to have in my life? Mm. Like, what kind of friends do I want to have in my life? Like, yeah, like mm. how did you maneuver into that space? Because I find that like everyone wants to be your friend mm. when you're at when you're in the limelight. You know, right. that, you know what? The mistake that I made in the, in the beginning stages of social media because go 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 no, I automatically yes, yeah, we are friends, you know. Mm. And that's the mistake I made. Um once I told me to my children, we are going to that later down in the line. But these people are actually not your friends. You know? mm. But when I'm saying, Oh no, but why? This mm. kind of when I call you did not take time to get to know people. So I've learned that so this could jump into you know, this is for myself, I mean I visit the you know, the visa about each home, you know, get to know people, you know. And another thing that in this study and I work with friendships, if you do not know God and you do not pray with me, you know, and fully spacey cuts and gets me and stress. Come on, like we're already going through things. I don't want to hear is this negative, guys. Obviously, wow. you know. Yeah. So if I have different amount that are around me who pray with me, pray for me, I pray for you. Do you understand? Mm-hmm. So those are the people that I want to have around me now. It has not been. Easy. That's so beautiful. Mm-hmm. That is actually so beautiful because I feel like you really need to have the right people around you mm-hmm. because it really just determines your progress in mm. life if you've got the wrong people and like you'll jump into relationships which is something that i also mm. used to do with friends mm. they're not really wanting to be friends with you they just want to get and you're just like oh but i definitely trusted you mm. A friend, like you don't like experience with each other. Mm-hmm. So while it's becoming so cool, like on my channel, when oh, we're going to do picky, picky, pick, we are going down like on my friends, you're going down. So there was someone that I trusted as a um, do was a go to each other. So my thing is, we are just my Nikki spotlight. You know that people are watching me young, you know. Mm-hmm. On. So I remember they, the the that into that is so embarrassing to me. It made me feel like you're and yes, man. Like oh, and then like, like how could they, do, they this? do this? Like embarrass me in front of people. Did you understand that? We, and I alone to be both in the same space. space do you understand? Mm. Took my bags, threw my bags, air rents in front of people. Oh, do you understand okay. what I mean? And I'm like, wow. do you understand? It is it is news, you know. I understand that we don't see for whatever reason, but mm. to embarrass me in front, in front of, of people, and you yeah, know, I have I know. this image. Like, to maintain, you've got a reputation. Do you understand? And I was like, you know what? No man, I keep saying, man, I. Told me, told me that you know you love people, good to good to, but when you embarrass me and do all those things, and big friends fight, you know, like it's yeah, one hundred percent, you know. But mm-hmm. to do those things, um, that's when you want, like that's just off, like and yeah. I, I can't take that anymore. So that's mm-hmm. when I knew when I, uh, I don't have the right people around me because if um, they told me I they wouldn't embarrass you, Ganjalo. There's mm-hmm. ways to talk to um, do when you are, you know. If you're having a disagreement, don't mm. like there's ways to address easy doing. Oh no, in the public eye, people will do anything. Even sometimes I go intentional net party. Does this make sense to embarrass the Pamgabanya Bank? Especially when they have this huge platform and people were taking videos, eh? There was a guy, it was on WhatsApp, people were sending me videos. It's here, like it's so embarrassing. Like it's so so embarrassing. Yeah, well, these are the things that I don't want like around me. If we having a disagreement, let's talk about it. Yeah, even gom, so okay. Gom, not in the heat of the moment while you're both mm-hmm. angry or can you while you're both emotional about it? Yeah. Still, even after that, you know, um, forgive um, to uti, uti, ah. uti, because you know that's when I knew when I go am naman. There's just something that's lacking in me because why do I keep allowing such things? It is only maybe I don't. I lack boundaries with other people. So I mean, um, allow people to just do as they please. It takes a man in a moment because sometimes when you do those things, I want your they can't accept. I said, hey, don't do this. I don't like it. Hey, well, they used to, uh, when they used to you being so accepting, mm. now all of a sudden. Our city, it's like 
right? Mm. So another thing for me is the fact that social media is your bread and butter. Mm. So you actually need to think that if you're going to do something to, like to someone mm. that uses social media as a way of making money, mm. of gaining an income, you need to be mindful that you can't jeopardize mm. e, 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 e reputation yeah, mm. because you must think that long to we are sebenza apa ku social media mm. it's not just a matter of ba uh, ah oh, you are well known mm. but you actually work and you earn an income from social media me yeah, i feel like it's very important as well and just guarding the people that you have around you cuz association is very, very important. important yeah yo it's so important i learned the harmony when they send bomba i jonga ngoko hai ko but i was able like you know but you have to go through these things in order for you i'm not saying that everyone that's on social media i mean i think these things they happen to maybe all to club you know because maybe someone needs to learn from me it doesn't really have to happen to you because you know when our it's like this space is pretty as protected and that's what i love 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 about you like you just don't go about it yo that's i don't know me that's the keep it like that and I like it you know sometimes you just oh, so many people have tried like I'll be invited to go to Stone Dune if my husband like he's also very spiritual mm-hmm. in the sense that he senses energies like mm-hmm. and connects a lot with his ancestors oh, yes. and God mm-hmm. yeah, I know some people don't believe in ancestors I but get ah <laughs> God, I believe in ancestors. ancestors. I believe that when you are stressing about things, pray about it. But sometimes from our quarters, we tend to go wrong. And then you have right. a man to up that that are there for you and with you. But no, let's pray. So you need to uplift, uplift your spirit yes. and to make you also feel like actually you can overcome mm. whatever challenge you are facing right now. God is there. Mm. So quarters, we are right. Talking about. God and ancestors yes, and energies yes. and having the right people around, around you. you. Yes. So yes. yeah, like in Cape Town, for example, like we'll get invited to stuff and we're just like, mm. like we are like, 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 like events <laughs> or in my events, okay? Yeah, like yeah. mostly events mm. and mostly like just people in general just wanting to be close to us. Mm. And him and I are both like. These are the, we'll go once maybe mm. and we'll be like these are not the people we want to have around mm. and then we're like no man we don't we don't mm. want these we kind of people this. you know no you know at, mm. at some point in my life I did, when I didn't really like have God in my life I mean kind of okay but I didn't have like connection and a relationship with strong God but you, so when I didn't have that. Oh man, Jana Tana ba, you Jana Tana ba around na ba. Oh my god, we can mess up. Yo, we get some phone back. Do you remember what's up, man? Oh my, we man, yo, we learn no part. What to call figure man? Okay, we man, we man. Oh figure, you are so drained. Okay, you are so drained. You feel so bad and guilty. Oh my, but I was having the time of my life. Why am I feeling this way? And then that's when I realized when I meet with the Akuka band to her energy vampires. Come on, I want to be the energy vampires who like can be. Um, they have good intentions for you, but but from basic angle, you don't understand <coughs> why are you feeling yes. sad? Why are you feeling like this? Can't you just grab a band? Do you understand about basic, you know? So when I know that I'm feeling that because there are times where I feel after a weekend mm. of spending time with people, like you, know, I was on my worst behavior this mm. weekend. I spoke to you. Just feel my dino comment. You had a, a a good weekend, but on Sunday night when you're closing your eyes, you're mm. like. It, it it can even be the conversations that maybe was here by now but what like we can from und at at is in domani that has nothing to do with you come up to ngela ngumamele izinto ezinjalo uzixhaba jonga this weekend i want to have fun mm-hmm. so it's all those things when so now i protect the peace wow. and my energy and my space like if you are around me now it's all about the space is right in the kwane and then we can have that fun you understand so it's all about that and the people that you have around you can drain you Yeah, okay, people can drink. Yeah. Having God and even our love for Tango go it's very important and I I need to compromise wow. on that moving forward with my life now. Let down you I'm not compromising mix. Wow. That is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> so I feel like you have like grown so much. There's so much wisdom like yes. from everything that you're saying and I can definitely say that God is going to take you so far. Oh, thank you Jesus. <laughs> yes, he definitely yes. is. Like and like everything that you have gone through, you can literally even write a book about all the experiences that <laughs> Am I confirming something? Oh my god, no I don't. Ba, 
that, girl. That is definitely. Do you understand? It's like a confirmation. Ah! I'm so, so happy. You never know, guys. You, you know? literally can. You mm. really, 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 really can. Because you've got love to. That's it. When it's social media, we call it. And you've like been through different phases. Yeah. You've grown so much. You've seen so much. And I feel like the 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 space we're in right now mm. with so many young girls i'm very passionate about development mm. in young girls yeah, in high school oh my goodness i would i was actually thinking about it yes i would love to actually be is going to because i have so Do much to tell me yes okay you move the influence on youtube okay fine but what am i teaching young girls who are watching me oh it's nice to look good but there's nothing wrong with that mm. but what else are you doing to uplift abanyaban because i'm not well born at all Sometimes you just need to what goes through go 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 this and that. Literally. Yeah. So I think that's it. it's all about just talking to them. If like there's nothing I don't think there's anything wrong with wanting to be on social media. And a lot of young girls who want to I wanna be on your Can you hand it who understand yo, you don't know what goes through. Like maybe we are one but we are handling it well. You understand? But there's a lot that goes behind, you know. The and scene the scene so, so it's all about telling them no, i don't mind being with, like telling the truth and just being authentic with what's happening but i don't mind you know do you understand because i know when i it's fine man you know we all go through things and if it's teaching someone else i really i'm happy with that as long as it helps maybe um, one or two, i am happy it doesn't have to be about about nations okay you no know, yeah. you know so i would actually love to go to schools and just talk right. you know yeah we should do that please i would love ah! that oh, yeah. <laughs> Coming. Same here, I've gone through so much and I feel like I haven't really shared yeah. the things that I've gone through. Mm. As a young girl, mm. you go through so much and there's no one really guiding you mm. through all the different stages. Mm -hmm. And I feel like for children to be saved, mm. but like there needs to be someone that is like, yo, I love that to be saved. You know, I love it. You know, I just right. Yes, right. yes. You know, I feel like now I'm growing up. Eh, oh, my mom was always there to. Mama, I think that I'm here. I was doing. I'm understanding because the main, the people, the people are going to be saying that I'm so now the people go to. Can't you? My God, now God, in God, now I understand why my mom used to tell me go to church. Tanaza, do this. Yeah, when I am as new to us, four man and get Pachalazo. But when I'm on the final lake, because one Ubugaluba, no bad man, who's loser, you don't know who you are, you know. So now I understand why my mom, I had to go through all these things only for me to understand, okay, this is why Mama Wai is. Why is it? Anything that you do, have God, you understand. Not saying that into a perfect Namu, you know. But what happened to say? That's the yeah. thing about, you know, and the oh God, God, we have a turn around by you, whether you do good, whether you do bad. All He wants is for you to have a relationship with Him and you are done. You go on it, you can make your mistakes, but you, and Fugus understand now, but is it so sad like pressure of being perfect who's mm. blessed about some things, you know? It's a journey, you know, you I try every see. day, you connect, you go on it. So yeah. I think, you know, it's something that a lot of girls would. Benefit, benefit from, from yeah. Yeah, especially if you yeah. want to be in the public eye because it is possible, you know. I think Abanabani's they always talk down on YouTubers and yes. influencers. Ah, so guys, just a picture. It's just, guys, there's a lot of work that goes Thank behind you. these things. These are people, you know what I mean? Now I have things to do. The people that are taking pictures of me have things to do. They have families to feed. It's not just social media. It's not just all oh, taking in pictures. One it's work, guys. You know, social media can take you to places. So mm -hmm. them how to use use social media how to go on it use it for positive things man you understand and stay away from his new scene though is negative and jay learn from me i've made my mistake <laughs> <laughs> learn from you know tina and ask <laughs> you for social media as a platform to grow yeah. grow closer to yeah. god connect with people mm -hmm. because it is possible you can do anything on social media you know that's so true wow mm -hmm. yo you said <laughs> So many things, guys. I even was tearing <laughs> up at some point because I'm like, girl, ah, so, this is work. This mm, pay, pays the, the bills. bills. Okay, you know, it literally brings in the money. Mm. It takes you to places mm -hmm. like you went on um, Afternoon Express yes. because yes. of social media. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. South mm. I feel like Tina, you know, we have a long way to go Yo, as South way. Africans. We are so close-minded to a lot of things. As if we don't allow people to make mistakes. We don't want to see people. Like if, if someone makes a mistake, they need we to cancel. 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 
Yeah, and it's so funny. I remember Ken Stacey, or people who are actually aspiring to be influencers. Like, exactly. But then how you and upon my own, I didn't think I want to be an influencer. Oh, I'm trying to upon my job and I get like influencer. But then how are you gonna do it when you? Chee. Chee. And we are begging Lisa from actually trying something. It progresses. So don't do that. You know. And do also bad by Kesana because if your heart is not in the right place. You definitely will forget about yes. your blessings, sweetheart. Yes. If you yes. are hating on someone out there or wishing them badly, or like your inner, your heart, your heart, really heart can like, stop. Can get get you before you mm. take it physically. But anyway, speaking about people um, being <laughs> bad on social media, yes. what has been like a moment where you're like, actually, okay, no, that is too deep. Let me rephrase that. <laughs> <laughs> You know, it's just like really the moment where you're like, actually, I I hate it here. I'm leaving. Like, how did you handle social media, like negative bullying, bullying or bullying. what? Yeah, because yeah. I've experienced that mm. where people just say stupid things, and I'm like, who mm. can be so mean? Like on mm. the phone, and I'm just like. Mm. How is this benefiting you? Like, mm. why you was it is this is You know, like, and I'm just yeah, like it's it's yeah, yeah. yeah. I think with me, it doesn't 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 affect her only because being as as in who I am. Now that I know mm. who I am, I know when I as in what bunch of people will do whatever and. Yes, yes, but I'm going to go, but I'm not as well as I'm going to take it easy on social media. But it's not a personal. It's not a personal. But it's not a, then, God, they say this to me. You, why would you say this to me? I didn't have done this. You know, because I didn't have done this. You know, 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 I didn't have done it was it. like sometimes I don't even care to know what people are saying on social media about me. Oh my, oh no, I'm trying to cut. No one is friend. That's a jump. We're trying to get on the side. Wow. I don't need these things around. I hate that thing. I'm just so good to be strong again. Because if we fully won, I'm also just fooling the genius dad. So it's those things that you know, man. Like now, in the end, I just protect my space. And this joke, why comments is? I'm trying to be careful. I'm not soon trying to learn to make a block of food in a quarry. No, no, that block of food in a quarry. Because look what they are saying about you. No, because for reality, it's like long long. Like, keep that day, keep yeah. that, yeah. you know, to yourself. Yeah. But it has not been easy because you can get now was really depression just because of yeah, people. That's true, you know. Yeah. And it's so funny. Like we talk about depression, mental health, anxiety, this and that. Mm-hmm. But oh my God, got a. It is it see a bullish about to see to see to see to see to so it's all about checking yourself before you you know. So cut ties with. Um, to enjoy all your access to now, you get the negatives of our social media, and just focus on me. If right now you decide to be negative, go back to you, man. Yeah, I'm getting down. Right. Yeah. I had a friend um, that would always like screenshot my ex's things mm. and send it to me. Now, what would you chat to And I'm like, okay, man. Okay, did you know? Like, what if my husband one day is going through my phone and mm. sees this? Like, who's out? Who's out? So I cut that person off mm. and like to the point where they were actually so crazy mm. she didn't even come to my um, my traditional wedding got away psyched up like, I'm so excited. On, on social media yes. Yes. Hey, hey, they are the most ever so happy for what you what was on the invitation that's you know, we posted like, on an invitation here John Chad like are you crazy you do not post a wedding invitation because that's crazy. Yeah, and also, did you ask permission? Like, did I? Come on, she really? don't do that. You yeah, know? I came mm. post that invitation that on the day mm. didn't show up, and I was like, "Go if you Do you understand? Go to full back front line whenever there are things happening in your life. In my work, I will announce about it. Okay. Oh my god, I get that for a lot. I get that a lot. So I'm so proud. Come on, so proud. Yeah, posting, yeah. posting on social media, and everyone on social media, they don't understand those things. But oh man, you yeah, are post. Oh, you guys are friends. Okay, my like best friend, yeah. And you're just like um. But there's nothing. And you're not best friend. Yeah, my friends are like you at home. And you can't talk on the phone. Pants. Oh my, no, my God. Come on, snap. I really long the long time. So I'm going to conversation with man. Okay, ninja. Like it's all been. 
what's that happening thing. in your life like yeah. what are you working on now mm-hmm. what is your next don't do you know you like, and some guy about Johnny and Jean how's your mom like how are your siblings like someone that's interested in knowing and personal like uh, uh, someone that really cares you understand mm. but sometimes mm. like, even though you talk to Lomdu you Kunzi, I want to share with you something because you still don't know what it is in you. So, like now that you're having this conversation, I'm learning so much about you know. Sometimes it's okay not to just go on a social media way. Me have real conversations with real like about your abalab, be in the present, present moment, you know, with yes, yeah. So that's what I'm also learning. Yeah. yeah. I want to know. Did you pray like for like your husband? I did. Really? Like were you I specific to God? Yeah. You just went with the flow God and you're not on the laundry laundry like it's like you know. I think that I I think I was specific mm-hmm. but without actually knowing what's right for me. Mm-hmm. Because Umnabendi said a lot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And like I was serving in the worship team mm-hmm. and I always thought that I'm gonna meet my husband at the church. Mm-hmm. And I definitely met him outside of church. <laughs> Oh, I was about to say I'm going to church. Ah. But no, I need to go to church. Maybe my husband is going to church. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, you for sure. And you keep looking for Umdu in the wrong place. Umdu, I'm going to find him. Find out. Ah, ah. Right. Red flag. You can't leave. You can't leave. Right. Red flag. You can't leave. 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 Oh, I'm your child. Do your thing. Yeah, literally. And then you're like, oh. And I'm going to keep going. You're going to keep going back. That's fine. That's what happened to me. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I literally kept on going back in the dungeon. Mm. And then God was like, my child, I have got plans for you to prosper you. And I was busy like, yo. Ah. Specifically made for you, mm. like for you, literally. Mm. Oh, now sometimes I'm like, fuck, this guy literally gets me without mm. even also that like, knows me, like how my sister knows me. Mm. He will, he like, I also know him, like, like, I think I should just his siblings mm. were besties, best friends, siblings, and also romantically involved mm. together. So when he came, I was like, ah, oh, this guy, like, from the first date, we hit it off, like, I was like, his energy is everything, mm. like, I want to be around him every day of my oh. life, like, I'm taking that, ah! <laughs> he's like, in a joke, he's around here all the no, time, all the time, okay. like, he doesn't make me tired, he doesn't make me, like, I need to look, you know, I need to be together, and he sees a version of myself that I don't see, and I see a version of him that like he, he doesn't see. see. Sometimes when he doesn't believe, but he can. I'm like, Baba, you've you got this. You're amazing, like, and he'll tell me, but dude, you're gonna fuck it up. Go do, th- go do your thing, like you know, like you. Okay, will, that's, you and know. that's what you need: someone to motivate you and push you. When mm-hmm. sometimes in life, it's like, oh, uh, you know, I right. have someone to. Oh, oh, Portia, dear Zelinda, that I need to do. So I think that's right. such an amazing, like, such a good thing that mm. you know everyone deserves that. Guys, pray right. to God, and whatever you need, you will get it. I believe. Pray if you believe, God. you will receive whatever it is that you ask for. Yes. In pray in yeah. Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Literally, oh, but I love, that, love, dude. Love, love, like love. I feel like you've got. I keep on saying this. It's so weird. I don't know why. <laughs> But I feel like the sky is literally the limit. Oh. Like I'm getting that mm. and that feeling and mm. right now and I feel like there's so much more to come. We love that who you choose. You know, it's just, it was come back. You know, it was also, <laughs> no, but I actually needed this. You know, you can't easily be comfortable. You can't easily. Yes, but if you're meant to be in front of a camera and shoot, it feels actually. It really feels amazing. I I'm enjoying it. Oh man, I'm really, so I'm glad. And I'm glad you actually it. like said yes now because mm. I feel like timing is so important mm-hmm. as well. Yes. So maybe before the timing was going to be off. But the fact that it happened now, mm. you know, God knew that right. mm. this is the right time. So. And I think that when I spoke to you the other time, I, I think I told you, but I, I'm not in a good space right now. And you understood. Mm. And I didn't feel like, oh, no, what's up? Because sometimes like, when you're back, I didn't know I got sorry, I feel it. But with you, I didn't get it. I was like, oh, thank God she understands. I, I know mm. that you understand, you know. And that's when I knew, but I, when the time is right, it will happen. It will happen. And look, at, yeah. look at 
Look at it now, right? You know? And I feel like now that you've even said when the ta- when you're not in a good space, mm. it's very good for you to actually not fall. Because mm. una, sometimes I'm in a bad space where mm. I'm like, actually, I really don't want to be in front of the camera because there's so much going on, and I'm like, ah, uh-uh, I really. If me, I had a fight with my husband. Mm. Okay. I don't want to shoot because oh, it's not going to be authentic. Mm. It's not because it's not going to be fake. And people will see that. And people can pick it up. Oh, what are you Dude, dubbing yourself? So. People will pick it up. So I feel like it's so important that you remain true to yourself and remain authentic as well. So yeah. people follow you, Flores. Stay true to yourself. Don't change yourself. But you know, my little Jamal Vicky, my little. And you know, trust me, you will flourish. You will grow. Do you? About time, I have a new So So I didn't think. You know, just let me tell the truth. Just mm. calm down. Do you understand? Like, when you when you team, mm. I know, man. I am only a cantana. I need to go to the gym alone. The team, And you know, when you team, ne, you are my man. You actually attracting. Positivity, ne growth, ne this is right. You understand? Yeah. But when I start acting like um, that I'm not, I'm not happy. The anxious, I'm this, I'm that. So guys, just be yourself. Do your own thing. If it's time for you to grow, it's time for you to want many subscribers. Then That's you true. will get that. Because I want to want to come and dance with DM. Vicky, how do I grow my subscribers? Was all cool and jolly, sad. Now I'm always like. How are you expected to answer this question? No. And yes, in that sense, this is all cool. I subscribe as a if you were be yourself. Do you, you be yourself? And you know, the people that love you must like follow you at the right time. So we stress and do you know? I think that's the thing. Most yet, not most yet, but about today, stress about the wrong things. Like if followers, if subscribers, right? That's it. Cause all cool, man. But when I just do, let the phone go. Yes, let Allah at the bottom. In my as soon as you call out from his auntie, when I do call, this is. No, take your time. It will come at the right time. It will definitely come at the right time. Mm. I enjoyed this conversation. I enjoyed it. <laughs> I really enjoyed this oh, conversation. I enjoyed it so, so, so oh, much. Goodness. Thank you so much for blessing us with oh, your presence. It was so you. lovely having you. Guys, I want to touch her all the time, but I don't know if you're an affectionate you. person because I come and give you random hugs. <laughs> I also enjoyed this conversation. <laughs> Guys, yeah. thank you so 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 much for watching. Thank you so 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 much for coming mm-hmm. through thank and just for opening up and t- talking from yes. the bottom of bottom your oh. ah! bottom of my heart. Okay. <laughs> the bottom of your mm-hmm. heart. Um yeah, we've had a mouthful to mm-hmm. Talk about mm-hmm. and yeah, I've learned so much, guys. Yo, oh, I've learned so, so 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 much. Especially about relationships, because yeah, so like, sometimes when you know hey. you need that, you hey. know, or you know, even if it was going to turn a band and be around people, you need to learn from other people who actually been through is needs and understand. So That's it's true. such a great experience to have in the conversation, you know. Now, like okay. I really enjoyed it. Yeah. Wow. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so Thank much. You. Please tell people to subscribe to your channel. Oh, guys. Oh, my back. goodness. <laughs> YouTube now, I've been 80 well, 70 till the last time I looked at 90k oh. subscribers. Yeah, okay. yeah. So, <laughs> almost on 100k. Yeah, so, 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 Time from us to you. Mwah, 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 mwah. Yes. yes. <laughs>